awfully quiet with this stuff today. Hey everybody, Andrew and Elijah here from Living the Northern Life. Today we got a new little project. Uh, we want to hook up a trailer to the back of our sled, but uh, this bumper is uh, not strong enough for it. So we had to go out and buy a special um, uh, hitch and bumper for it. And uh, that's the project we're up to today. Uh, if you like this kind of stuff, uh, subscribe to the channel and uh, give us a thumbs up. And leave your comments down below. Okay, so there are two bolts, one on the back over here and one over here. But it looks like our bumper, our new bumper, has three holes in it. The Torx bit is a T30. And when we get this changed, we're going to have to drill another hole. So we've got to do some measuring and, uh, and then drill the hole. Do this from the other side. So the spots are marked. Uh, I'm going to take a center punch. I'm going to take a center punch and uh, mark that and then go get a, a drill bit that's the right size and uh, we'll get to this in a minute. All of the new bolts already have Loctite on them, so that should be good to go. Uh, just got to put in the ends here. We just open this box up, and this is our trailer hitch, and it's just gonna pop on like that with the bolts that they've provided, some instructions, so we'll get that done. Tell us anything fun? Well, go to the website to get the instructions. I'm just going to go get the, uh, the right Allen key and the right uh, socket. I'm going, to use a, I'm going to use an open end wrench. It's a 13 millimeter and the Allen key looks like it's a 5. These are nylon self-locking um, nuts, uh, so we don't have to like kill these guys. We're just gonna snug them up and uh, we'll put them in the other bolts for now. Nope. These ends do go in a specific way. You can see that it has to match that way. So, we just kind of wiggle this guy back and forth, and then it will go in. There is a little, I don't know if you guys can see it or not, there's a little catch in here that's got to go past to clip into that little hole so it doesn't fall out. And 
again, these bolts already have Loctite on them. All right, so the reason that we uh, installed this new trailer hitch, uh, you guys just saw that we were uh, pulling around the sleigh, uh, but we do have a surprise coming uh, probably sooner rather than later. Uh, we're going to try to do some maple syrup here and we need a, a sled to be able to pull the maple syrup around when we're gathering sap. And uh, I'm gonna have another video there of uh, getting all of our maple syrup stuff ready, uh, but that'll be the next one. Well, that's it for this one, guys. Uh, like I say, the... Uh, uh, we were using a T30 for the Torx uh, with a 13 millimeter and a five uh, mil um, uh, Allen key here uh, for the bumper. Uh, we had to drill that. I don't, I'm not giving any measurements on that because it could be different on yours. Uh, but that's it for this one. Uh, if you guys like this stuff, uh, give me a thumbs up, leave your comments down below, and it would sure be great if you guys would subscribe. And until the next one, keep living the Northern life. Thanks for watching Living the Northern Life. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and our website. Remember to click subscribe, click that bell notification, and give us a thumbs up for the videos you like.